and welcome to another episode. This time we're travelling south in our caravan from uh, North Queensland. We stay at the coastal town of Lucinda. We're entertained by the most stone curlews we've ever seen on our trip. Matter of fact, we've got quite a few animals and some uh, quirky stopovers as well. We visit the beautiful Wallaman Falls in North Queensland and there's lots more great beaches. So join us on our next adventure. We start this trip departing from the beautiful free camp at Bovinda, where you can stay for up to three nights. It's right on the creek and it's dog friendly. We stayed at Ingham for a few days, famous for the pub with no beer, featuring Slim Dusty. Uh, Mercer Lane, which uh, has got some beautiful mosaics and it's right next to JK's Deli. The JK's Deli, which is uh, great to go for uh, coffee in the morning and one of the best delicatessens Anne said she's ever found. Tido Wetlands was located right across the road from where we're staying in town. Great trail, used for bird watching. You can even do some croc spotting. We stopped at Mission Beach for lunch. Um, parked on the beach to look across to Dunk Island, but unfortunately a little bit of rain and showers and cloud, we couldn't see it too well. It was just a quick stopover. Cardinal is another beautiful coastal town um, on the Cassowary Coast. Beautiful walkway along the front with great views across to Hinchinbrook Island. We then start at Lucinda, which is uh, home of uh, the longest jetty in the southern hemisphere, almost six kilometres long. It's used for bulk sugar. It takes the sugar 22 minutes to travel the distance on the conveyor to the waiting shiploader at the other end. Shadow was happy just to look at the jetty from the beach. Very picturesque town, um, beautiful view of Hinchinbrook Island. We've never seen so many stony curlews in one place. They certainly fitted in well at the uh, caravan park where we were staying. The old jetty is now used as a uh, fishing hotspot for the locals. This young lad uh, unfortunately had hooked a uh, stingray. Holloman Falls, very easy drive to uh, get up here. Um, very close to the car park as well, only uh, probably 10, 20 metres to the lookouts. It's uh, a drop of almost 270 metres, which is the uh, biggest single drop waterfall in Australia. And the height above sea level is, is about 540 metres. Quite spectacular.
Rolling Stone Resort, about 50 kilometres north of Townsville, is a great place to chill out for a few days, right on the water. Beautiful tropical grounds to uh, stay on, uh, and these canals actually are stocked with barramundi. And there's a uh, beautiful creek close by. But uh, last time I come here it was very good for fishing, but this time not as good, but still good to have a look and uh, try and spot the uh, resident croc. Home Hill is a very popular free camp for overnight uh, travellers, right uh, one street back from the main street. It's class as a comfort stop, it's uh, one street back from the main street. Uh, the spirit of Queensland came rolling through just as we were setting up. Uh, but a good place to stay for an overnight stopover. Now just south of Home Hill we read about this quirky little low cost camp right on the coast named the Funny Dunny. So it uh, inspired us to go out and have a look, we thought we'd stay for a night or two. cost camp five dollars a night and we were uh, greeted by the caretaker, caretaker at the gate to uh, put us in the right direction. The dunny actually looked quite new so uh, I'm not sure why they call it the funny dunny. It's about a hundred meters back from the beach but uh, easy access. Heading further south, we make our way down to Bowen, where we stay at a farm stay. Come across a few cattle on our way in, always interesting. <laughs> Bowen's in the uh, Whitsunday region. It's um, Quite a nice little town, population over 10,000, and it's got some of the most beautiful beaches you can see in Queensland. Shadow and Mia are enjoying a uh, stroll on the water until, wait a minute, Mia seems to be stranded on a rock. Now I could see Anne was concerned for Mia's safety. But all worked out well, back on the beach again. Rose Bay was one of our favourite hangouts while we were in Bowen. Some of us were a little worn out after our day's adventures. Now for some outtakes. Most of the uh, footage we take, it always looks picture perfect. But believe me, it wasn't always. We did have a little bit of rain up in North Queensland. This is up in Ingham, one of the wettest places in Queensland. While I was waiting for Anne to get some milk, dash cam captured this caravan going past. Watch the left wheel. Completely came off. There it is again in the replay. Peter, what's that? Are you on a diet, are you? No, no, no. This is just breakfast. She was shocked. We've got eggs, flour and Absolutely sugar Absolutely shocked. Heart attack material. It's so it's some sort of health bar, is it? Or? No, it's got everything it's the nutri grain has got. It's got wheat. It's got eggs, it's got milk, it's got flour, and a little bit of sugar. And how many calories would that be? Now sometimes when I've got the cameras rolling, I just nicely ask everyone to be quiet so I can capture the natural sound. And this is the response I got. See what we have to put up with on the trip? Peter, yep. I think you've hooked up to the wrong van. 
<laughs> you started this trip in a Crusader, a and we seem to be finishing in a it's Jayco. A I just hooked up to anything but the way. Oh. Well, it looks quite smart. Yeah. Here's Robin. Pull it putting, back. putting the flap down. Pull it back and down. I, so. can't, I can't reach it. Hey, I want to get the Jayco in. All right, ready? Yeah. Take our selfies. Yep. <laughs> Go. Yeah, you take it.